Mahesh, did you know that angles can be measured? Really, Didi, are angles measured in centimeters? <laughs> no, no. The measure of an angle is expressed in degrees. How do you measure the degrees of an angle? To measure the degree of an angle, we use an instrument called the protractor. Let's learn all about the protractor. Protractor A protractor is an instrument used to measure an angle or draw an angle of a given measure. The protractor is semicircular in shape. This shape is divided into 180 equal parts. Each part is called a degree. This is how we write one degree. The markings on the protractor are numbered at intervals of 10. Therefore, it is numbered as 10, 20, and so on up to 100. And 80. These markings are numbered from left to right and from right to left. As the semicircle is one half of a circle, the center of the semicircular protractor is also the center of the circle. The diameter is called the reference line of protractor. To measure an angle using a protractor. Let's now see how to use a protractor to measure an angle. Place the protractor at the vertex of the angle. Point Q. Find the zero on the protractor that coincides with arm of the angle. This is the zero that lies on ray QR. Start counting from zero on the reference line to the coinciding line. The number is 60. This number is the measure of the angle. Therefore, the measure of angle PQR is 60 degrees. Let's now see how to use a protractor to measure an angle. Place the protractor at the vertex of the angle. Point Y. Find the zero on the protractor that coincides with arm of the angle. This is the zero that lies on ray YZ. Start counting from zero on the reference line to the coinciding line. If the arms of the angle are covered by the protractor, extend the arms before measuring the angle. This number is the measure of the angle. Therefore, the measure of angle XYZ is 110 degrees. Now, let's try to measure the angle in the given example. Find the measure of angle NML using a protractor. Place protractor at point M. Check the zero on ray MN. Start counting from zero on the reference line to the coinciding point on ray ML. Read the measure on the protractor. Angle NML measures 120 degrees. Let's try another example. Find the measure of angle QPO using a protractor. Place protractor at point P. Check the zero on ray QP. 
start counting from zero on the reference line to the coinciding point on ray PO. Read the measure on the protractor. Angle QPO measures 40 degrees.